Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Cancer April 14, 2023. If you need backing or support, today is good for getting it. There is some tendency for small problems to crop up early in the day, after which it's easier to apply yourself. Taking care of details and paying more attention to practical priorities or your health can satisfy you most. Accomplishing something is rewarding. Venus has just begun its transit of your friendship sector, where it will visit until May 7, bringing good-natured energy to your social life and networking activities. You gain more fulfillment through activities with and for others. Equality in your interactions is sought and valued more than usual. Allowing your friends more space and freedom is important now, and you may need the same. If you need to make peace with someone, this is a good time to do so. It's also strong for joining a group, working together with others as a team, socializing with associates, networking efforts, and setting long-ranging happiness goals. While you've been feeling fired up about your professional life over the past week with likely new projects or contracts on the line, something seems off. In fact, your significant romantic partner probably even pointed it out to you already. This is because mental Mercury, our cosmic messenger planet of the mind and communication, is in a pre-shadow phase within your solar house of achievement. While you'll likely see plenty of confusion and delays take hold in late April or May, it's actually clearing up your schedule to focus more on dating or making love to your significant other. Try to keep your calm. There might be a lot going on internally and externally throughout your workday when the Moon in Capricorn opposes Mars in Cancer. Usually, these two transits are considered debilitated. However, they are in mutual reception which means there is potential for each debilitated planet to help the other out. With this in mind, you can likely take charge of your work life and inner annoyances with a professional attitude. If something is going on, take a step back to cool off before addressing your frustrations regarding your work life. Two weeks after the Dwarf Planet series return to your income sector the Moon is not only in your work sector but at a friendly aspect to the remaining planets in your career sector after Venus, the planet of money left two days ago. A massive amount of water has passed under the bridge since the Moon was here four weeks ago, with a valuable chance to regroup and get your bearings across the income, work and career fronts. You will benefit from having variety in your exercise regimen. Boredom can make you give up on a practice that is essential to your health, so try and acquaint yourself with a few forms of exercise that you find challenging and enjoyable. There are literally hundreds of exercise apps and subscriptions on the market today, many of them free or of little cost. Try something that you've never done before but always wanted to learn. This will keep boredom at bay. If you want to get anything done on this day avoid contact with others as much as you can. It will be almost impossible for you to stay clear of talking with this vibration in the air, given your love of socializing. And before you know it, a 5-minute chat will turn into an hour. Try to stick to the tasks you have to do, and let voicemail pick up the phone for you. Just make plans for some fun this evening. At the same time that the Moon is making its first visit to your work sector since Pluto left and with it a valuable chance to regroup, it forms a friendly aspect to the planets in your career sector that are regrouping after Venus left two days ago. This is creating a lot of positive energy and insight on the job and career fronts at a time when the dynamics of this professional year are undergoing significant change. Yet with the Sun still seven days away from your career sector and Jupiter returning next week there is also a need to keep your mind and your options open. The Moon's departure from your romantic sector yesterday has given both the spirit of romance and adventure a boost and with perfect timing. On their own, the romantically charged lunar vibes of the last few days would have given the spirit of romance a boost but a friendly aspect to the Sun and Jupiter, just as they aligned in an adventurous part of your chart has not only brought the spirit of romance and adventure together but has locked it into place. Our eyes in the sky. Today, the Capricorn moon forms aspects with Jupiter and the Sun, both in Aries, which can ignite a powerful desire to live life to the fullest. 
However, it's important to avoid overindulging in the delicious gifts that the universe has in store for you. The temptation to seek out the highest quality goods and indulge in lavish experiences may be strong, but it's crucial to guard against the perils of extravagance and excess. Under this astrological influence, you may find yourself drawn to other cultures and attracted to successful people with a great deal of wealth. While it's natural to have aspirations for a more luxurious lifestyle, it's important to remain realistic and grounded in your approach. It's essential to avoid getting swept up in excessive optimism and unrealistic expectations that can leave you feeling unfulfilled and dissatisfied with your circumstances. Take a practical approach and focus on what you can realistically achieve, rather than chasing unattainable fantasies. You may be feeling overwhelmed by the numerous suggestions for healthy activities that promise to enhance your well-being. It's important to carefully weigh the risks and calculate the likely outcomes before diving in. Overexerting yourself can lead to stress and burnout, so it's crucial to remain in total control and avoid pushing yourself beyond your limits. While it's important to remain skeptical of unrealistic promises, don't be afraid to explore new experiences and enjoy the learning process. Just remember to stay balanced and maintain a healthy perspective as you navigate the challenges and opportunities that come your way. With just six days remaining before the sun departs from your income sector and separates from its alignment with Jupiter, it's important to remember that there is still much to be revealed. The upcoming eclipsing new moon, which will occur while the moon is in your income sector, promises to bring a plethora of new options to the forefront. As such, it's essential to keep your mind and your options open, and not to prematurely make any decisions. Your desire to improve your financial situation is strong, and you're eager to understand as much as you can about your current circumstances and how to improve your position for the future. It's crucial to prioritize this challenge and to learn exactly how to turn your aspirations into reality. Recognizing that a solution is within reach is a satisfying feeling that will bring you untold benefits. In terms of your health, it's essential to prioritize reducing stress levels. Even though you may be experiencing pressure in various areas of your life, it's important not to let that be a reason to abandon your exercise routine or become completely lethargic. Instead, focus on finding a balance between what's appropriate for your body and mind, and a recovery process that suits you. Avoid overdoing it and be sure to make gradual progress toward your fitness goals. Remember that even though the clock is ticking, there are still opportunities to come, and it's important to remain open to new possibilities. By staying focused, managing your stress levels, and being patient, you can achieve your goals and create a better future for yourself.